All right, this is a special day here. Uh, um, I know, you know, I told you we were going to have some special guests coming. And uh, today it's a fellow I've worked with for a long time. Uh, you probably recognize him from his extensive work in film and TV. Happy Jack Hodge, as they call him. And uh, we've worked together quite a while. I'll give you a little background here. Um, back in the day, we've shared, we shared an agent. We used to do a lot of work together and worked on a pilot with Forrest Tucker, who many of you probably know. Oh, yeah, for, oh he had a long <laughs> Um, <laughs> he did, he loves yeah, uh, so, but anyway, uh, he remembered me. He was in town at the Fiesta Dinner Playhouse, and I was back here in San Antonio <laughs> for a little while, and uh, he passed away. So unfortunately, uh, 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 Jack here was going to play the son of Forrest Tucker, and then we ended up shooting again with Jack doing the Forrest Tucker part, which yeah, is, yeah. Uh, anyways, I want him to explain a few things about the craft and what it's really like to be on a film set. Okay, this is, this is experience speaking right here. So this is once again something really, hey, before we start, are there any questions here? Oh, okay, here we go. Question for you there, Jack. You said that Forrest Tucker had the longest schlong in Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> he did. I, so. I always thought it was Gary Cooper. Oh, honey, you remember we had a conversation about this. You know, it was Milton Berle. They, they had a measuring contest. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, let's, let's move That's along exactly here. Right. That's exactly right. I'm just gonna give you the floor, so <laughs> here we go. Howdy, how y'all doing? Happy Jack from Midway Motors. Come on down. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, he wants me to talk about what it's like getting on the set. Well, usually you got to find who you're supposed to check in with. Usually everybody's running around trying to get a cup of coffee, so you find out who you're supposed to check in with, and you check in with them. And a lot of times they'll use just some flunky, you know, uh, checking you in. And, well, she's over here, and they're over there, and nobody knows what's going on. <laughs> So then you get to go see the director. He'll come in and look at you and uh, ask if you remembered what we talked about four weeks ago. And a hot dog. Oh, do it exactly like you did it before. And it's like, it's crazy. It's crazy. Well, business. that's the job. <laughs> yeah, but it's still crazy. Well, they don't know what they want half the time. You go in there and they, they say they want a tall basketball player and they end up sh with a short little pygmy, you know? <laughs> this isn't where I wanted this. Can you, can we, let's just kind of, like, sure, let's talk sure. about... Uh... When we get in front of the camera, oh, that's... Uh, okay, they have what they call three shots. What they do is they set you up this way and they set you up the other way. And then they put the camera right here and then Denny gets to do his bit. And then they move the camera and put it on his shoulder here, and then I get to do my bit, and then they put the camera over there, and then we get to do the bit again. So we don't do it one time. You don't do it two times. You got to do it three times because they're too dang cheap to buy three cameras. It's hard. It's hard work. You got to remember all of what you're doing. And uh, It's about as monotonous as listening to... To Happy Jack here. <laughs> it's on, pretty on the dang set. boring. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, you get to meet lots of girls. Oh, yeah. And then, oh, yeah. And then the one time I checked, oh, they had the prettiest girl. Oh, she was, she was a great production assistant, I'll tell you. <laughs> you remember her, Jackie? Mm. <laughs> you just see, look at that woman's face. You don't feel like you're getting any useful information here? Oh, oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, I'm, I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, I mean, yeah, this yeah. is like being a has-been 101. You can hear about what has been. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, you know what a has-been is, don't you, Jack? <laughs> I'm looking at one. What the hell are you fuck talking about? You. You, you, fuck you. Fuck you. You talking a has-been? I've done more shit than you even thought about. Oh, you did Guys and Dolls and jo I didn't do Joseph Guys and Dolls. Josephine Theater. I didn't even work there. You're yeah. still full of shit. Yeah. yeah. Look, I do you a favor. I bring you in here. I'm trying to help you out, buddy. And by calling me a has-been, thank you very it much. It was a I joke, all right? It was a, a joke, joke. joke. Yeah. 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 I am not going to shut the fuck up. Hey, hey, you hey, make cut. Me shut the That's fuck up. That's it. You're out of here. <laughs> Look at him run. Hey, aren't you Happy Jack? Howdy! <laughs> How you doing? I'm all right. I'm happy all right. Jack. Reverend Russell. Nice to meet yeah, you, Reverend. Yeah. I noticed you. you. You do those spots on TV. That's right. Every Sunday the... morning. There, you, there go. you go. Yeah, all right. yeah. I'm usually just waking up by then. Denny! Wait. Hey, Denny, hold on. Wait. Denny, wait. Wait, hold on, man. Wait. Hey, Denny! Dude, are, are you okay? I guess Happy Jack ain't so happy anymore, is he? 
Look, forget that dude, man. I mean, look, you always said commercials were junk. That's all he does. You don't need that guy. Well, I do need him. I've needed him for 20 years. He's been a friend of mine. Well, I mean, look, friend or not, it was, it was a jerk move, man, and you didn't deserve that. That was so fucking embarrassing, man. Yeah, that was, that was rough. Yeah. That was rough, man. But it doesn't matter. You're Denny. I've seen your resume. I know what you can do. I mean, I know your talent. When I was in LA recently, I went to Schlockfest, right? And I saw all these great directors. I ran into Jay Robertson. I mean, I didn't run into him. I was waiting in line to meet him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You were in LA. What? Yeah, I was in LA for a little bit, um, for, for a little bit, but, but, I, but I went to Schlockfest and I met him and I met all these incredible directors and Jay Roberts and we talked and it wasn't like- oh, wait, When was this? When were you there? A little bit ago, not that long ago. Five years, what? It's like a week ago. I thought you were doing commercials. Well, I, I did a few and then I took a trip to LA for a little bit to, to do some things and I did Schlockfest and Why, why didn't you tell me about this? We just talked. You, you didn't mention anything about going to LA. I didn't want to tell you about it. I didn't want you to think that I was bailing on the class. But I wanted to go and check it out and see what it was like. And it was so exciting. It was amazing. I met all these incredible directors and Jay Roberts and we talked and it wasn't like- Pig slaughter? Pig slaughter. But he was so cool, like I said. And, and I've got Janet's, his assistant's number and I got his card and he was like, come over and talk sometime. Just- You got his assistant's card? Yeah, yeah. A week ago? Something like that, yeah. Okay. Wow. Pig slaughter, huh? Yeah, it's an incredible movie. Okay, uh, this has got my private number on here. I don't give this to many people, okay? Take that, don't share it with anybody, please, okay? And if you talk to his assistant, what's, what's his name? Janet. Janet, okay, because I've got an idea for a script, I think that, that, and I could play the fucking lead in it. You could play a part in it, too. I'd love to be great. Uh, hold on, let me think a minute. Okay, do that for me. I will. And next class, gratis, free, no charge. Okay. Yeah. I think things are gonna start happening now. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And uh, you're on my email list for the next round of classes. Thank you. Yeah, but you're gonna contact me before that, right? I will. I will definitely tell you about this. Um, yeah. Listen, I'm, I'm gonna go back in there and say goodbye to everybody. You wanna come with me? No, I'm okay. I gotta start working on that script. Yeah. Thank you.